I don't want to put my good limp roller. Can you even see the cat hair though? Hello, family. Hey guys, it's Joel here, aka Galax, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Recent pickups. Not done any recent pickups yet, so this isn't a January recent pickup. If you are new to the channel and you haven't yet subscribed, if you do like this video, don't forget to subscribe. It is completely free. I do two videos a week, most of the time. I have my Instagram, at Galax which you can follow if you are interested in my kind of style. So, um, this shirt, I don't know if I've spoken, I've spoken about this on my channel, but I don't know if it's been in a recent pickups. Um, I can't really remember, but I'm still obsessed with it. It's from Overload, which is a, I think it's a Korean brand. I literally sent them an email or a DM and was like, can I buy this? Because their store was in Korean. And they said, yeah, and sent me a PayPal invoice. I just paid it. It's a contrast stitch denim shirt and it is so nice. It is covered in cat hair at the moment, but I can't find my lint roller for the life of me, so I'm just gonna have to deal with it. Um, I like how oversized it is. Um, I love the buttons on it, how shaky they are. I love the contrast stitch, contrast stitch. I've been looking for a shirt like this for so long. You do not know how long I've been looking for a shirt like this. I finally found it. So I'm happy AF. Next up, now I was wearing this in a video a few weeks ago, uh, the other week, and it is the Vetmont Heavy Metal Tee, so it has a big skull, and it has the Vetmont kind of death metal writing on it as well. It was down in Selfridges from 600 to 150 pounds, and I was considering it buying it, I was considering buying it when it was 600, so when it was 150, um, I was like, hell to the yeah. Um, so I got that, that was thanks to my friend at Selfridges who actually put it behind the till. Super oversized. I am heading to, I don't know if you knew this, if you don't follow me on Instagram, why not? Um, but I am heading to LA for the whole month of April. Um, I've been trying to look for like lighter clothing to wear, so I can just wear this. I can just throw this t-shirt on, a pair of shorts, a nice pair of trainers, a cap, and go around LA to do my business. And yeah, I really, really like this. <laughs> Next up, I got a new cat package from the guys over at Hi-Fi FNK. Uh, I want to say a huge thank you to them because, because I love their clothing and they like what I do too. Um, so they are nice enough to send me a few things now and again. I made a video of how to order from them, so you send them an email. Again, with most Korean websites and stuff you send, you have to send them an email because you can't usually check out of their checkout process on the website. And it's all in Korean, unless you know Korean. I got this oversized red sweatshirt with a big drop shoulder. And it says like 73 and then brother, sister. Don't know why, but it's cool. I've been wearing this a lot recently. I was wearing this in a video the other day as well. I've been wearing a lot of jewelry recently as well, if you haven't noticed. And I'm really liking like plain pieces with them jewelry thrown over the top. Um, especially like primary colors like red, I got a yellow hoodie in my Zara shopping video which I did last week, if you haven't checked that out, you can check that out. Comfort is my main priority in all the things that I wear. I will link to these Hi-Fi FNK pieces if they are still in stock. I've been wearing this loads as well. It's a, basically a plaid flannel shirt, whatever you want to call it. Um, it's kind of lined as well. I um, feel very like a farmer in it, but I'm enjoying that. Um, it's black and red, my favorite colors at the moment, and it's super oversized. It's more like a jacket, like a shacket, like a shirt jacket. So it's just really, really fun to wear. So I throw this over like a hoodie, or like I wore that sweatshirt with this thrown over the top as well, because it's really, really comfortable, warm, and cozy again, and because it's so freaking cold here in London, it's nice to have that extra layer of padding rather than just, you know, like a flannel shirt. And it has an inside pocket. Bonus. Ooh, what's that? My inhaler, yes. Now next on the agenda is two pairs of trousers from Menace. I've had a new delivery from the guys at Menace of some of their new stuff, which I'm really, really excited about. I'm gonna save the best piece to last, so I'll show you these two and then we'll go on to that one. The first pair of trousers. Now I'm trying to, this year, I'm trying to branch out my trouser department because I do wear black jeans a lot, but that's because I really, really like them and I think they go with everything and that's just my kind of style. Um, but I'm open to trying other things. So when Menace sent me this package, in it was a pair of khaki utility trousers. I think I used to wear these when I was younger, 
like um, car not cargo but like utility trousers with like loads of pockets on and stuff like that. Um, these are actually a really nice shape. They have side pockets, back pockets, and they kind of taper towards the ankle as well. They have a little tie string. Um, but I will show you what these look like on, and I've left a link to these in the description below. <laughs> They do them in other colours as well. I think these are brown rather than khaki, I can't really tell. And the next pair of trousers as well are a little bit different. I'm going to bring up the actual name of them. Black Gingham Crop Raw Hem Trousers. Ta-da! They come with a little uh, metal band on them as well, kind of like as if you were going to put a chain on them. Um, and they're cropped, which is my favourite. Yeah, they have a raw hem, um, and that's it. So I'm going to show you what they look like on. When I look back to before we were together There was no pressure, no pain, just pleasure Now this next piece is kind of pricey in terms of Menace because Menace uh, tends to keep things at like 100 or just over 100 for like a really nice jacket. Believe me, this is worth it. It is a suede, black suede biker jacket and it such a nice fit, I can't even... Everyone always asks me about this one. This suede biker was from Urban Outfitters like three years ago and literally whenever I wear it, I get, I get loads of messages asking where this is from and you can't buy it anymore. Nowhere does anything similar. Whereas Menace has just brought out this, which is extremely similar. I still need to take all the tags off the zips and stuff. Um, but it is £250, so I know that it is on the steep side, but it is a real leather suede jacket. And the fit is awesome, and it's so nice. Again, this is something that you can wear all year round. Like, I've had this one for years, so I assume that I'm going to have this one for years as well. Really, really nice. I think this fit might even be nicer than my old one. Um, but I will show you what it looks like on, and you guys can be the judge. Um, but I was so, so excited when this came through the post, so thank you Menace for sending me this. There is a link to this in the description below. I got it in a size large. And to finish things off, I got a new chain from Chain and Abel over on ASOS, which I'll link below, and rings a ring from Serge Denims and a dragon bracelet from Serge Denims as well. So I'll leave those in the description below. Um, if you enjoyed this video and haven't yet subscribed, don't forget to subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know what your favourite piece was in the comments below. Give this, big, give, this big year? give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it and I will see you in my next one. Thanks for watching guys. Bye!